Okay, well, it uh, looks like BE is going to be muted for the, for the rest of this match until it's time for uh, Calvin to realize that he's got that boy muted. Going to the first game right now. Looking real good for uh, Res Fresh right now. Are we back? Okay, here we go. I, I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure. Here we go. Rest fresh in the building. See if he's uh, see if he's uh, that much of a. Wait, he went Ness? Yeah, I want to see if he's that much of a of a um, PK fire aficionado as uh, Rest Living is though. Well, we'll find out. I mean, essentially, all he has to do is PK fire and pivot grab. Oh yeah, that's the Rest Live way right there. Rest Live lifestyle. Rest to live by. <laughs> Not doing too bad of a job. I mean, he's in a considerable lead. It's with that yo-yo game. Now, if he wins with this, I mean, this is this is some kind of disrespect. I, I am up. He doesn't really play his character. It's not his main. Uh, and every time Sigma gets mad close to beating his main, yeah. I wouldn't even consider this like a like a serious Ooh, that secondary was good. form. That oh, was my God. Excellent. Nice. Had that banana in hand, used it to drop low and take that stock, interrupting Deep Kong's recovery. Excellent play there from Pink Fresh. Eats the forest match, however. As Sigma tries to regain a bit of stage control here. It's got to be kind of bad right here. It's weird how, how much Rez is in this. Like, they're living vicariously through that man as if he just passed away or something. I'm telling you. We have four Rez. Someone's playing his character. Like, <laughs> look, 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 look at Joe. It looks like, you know that thing for Adam's family? Cousin It. Mm. <laughs> That's exactly how Joe looks right now. <laughs> we got Cousin It in the building. That's oh my God. name. Oh, my God. See oh. what Joe's here. Cousin It. Cousin It, boys. All right, man. So uh, he got that first stock. Pink did get that first stock, and he's not been able to really do much after that. Res, uh, Reslev, or for Res, Siegel doing a really good job just uh, getting whatever damage he can, making sure he doesn't take too much. The up throw is going to finish him. Got him. Okay. Okay. Ooh, nice up, Smash. Just going to retreat to that platform real quick to start his assault. Good stuff, man. We got a 1% difference between these guys. Immediately uh, getting some more damage on them right there. Very nice. Yeah, this drone's crazy. All right. But it looks like, um, looks like Seagull's starting to figure out just a little bit here. Okay. I don't know if he's trying to show up Red Lip or no. Yeah, I feel like that's what he's trying to do right now. But all he is going to eat that down, uh, down tilt to Fort Air. Finisher right there from uh, Seagull. A little bit of a B&B &B from that boy. Scooped up. Got him out of there. Uh-oh. Got the grab. Uh, probably not going to be able to get too much off of that. Try to go for the Waveland grab. Yet again, that would have been really nice, but I don't think he would have been able to get a finisher. Yeah. So, taking quite a bit of damage, too. Got that first stock and just has not been able to do too much after that. Good grab. Uh, nope, no back air. That platform really coming in handy. Oh, Ooh, that's unfortunate. it. unfortunate. Pink Fresh, who started out really strong right now, breaking out this pocket nest, has been reduced to his last stock while Siegel still remains at a solid three. Wow. And some pseudo wow. chain grabs right here. All right, well, if you, when, you, when you do eye that wrong, you definitely just get scooped up Absolutely. a couple times. And now we got Rez the backseat coaching right now, but how did you not know this? Like, well, Rez, how did you not make. Anyway. Marsh is <laughs> playing the character right now. In grand. Oh, no answer? Okay. Nah. Wow, all right. Got his own chain grabs in there. Ooh. Trying to go for a like, so mix-up. Not going to be able to get it. That platform definitely coming in handy for Joe right now. Yeah, this is all but over right here. Got to say. Yeah, 111. I mean, one good fair. Oh, I saw it. It's like one good fair, and he was coming up with it. Just happened to throw them hands out just in time. Woo, that's it. Not quite, but I don't know if he's recovering. No, he's good. No, you good. You good. Please don't. Please don't hit the salty run back. Oh, I thought. I, I saw I the pause worried. right now. I was like, I was on, worried, man. too. I was worried, too. Oh, well. Like we ain't going home no time soon. Oh, I guess not. <laughs> you know, I mean, there was one of those nights where we could have, everyone could have made it home at comfortably before 12, went to sleep. Nope. Oh. Nice grab. Eh. Right now, Rez in the back was saying, if you want to win, just try PK Fire. Some stellar Which, uh, advice. Not not, not going to lie. That's definitely some good advice right now because it's definitely not looking good for you. Like, yeah, you got to whip out all the tools. Ooh, down smash. That's going to take the first stop. And Seagull right now is just enjoying this free ride to set number two in grands. Oh, yeah. Scooped up. Pretty oh. much essentially all it is. I mean, he's, he's got that free ride to grands 
set two. Yeah, yeah. I mean, and that's. I, I I wonder at what point is uh, Marcus even gonna switch if he decides to switch. Like I feel like is he gonna wait till set two game two where you already lost game one and then just try to win it like that? Because uh, right now this is not looking too good for you. I mean I'm just not sure what the logic was behind this choice to go next. I, th I thought the objective was to finish off and win the tournament. Not so allow your opponent, oh, you know, a good a to, get on to take take it all the way back. Oh yeah. I mean, that man was really not, he wasn't a fan of just, you know, taking the whole thing. Maybe just like the challenge. Oh, nice grab by Siegel. And you should hang your head in shame, sir. All right. Now, when Rezo gives him the uh, cliff notes on how to do this matchup, I know at least PK Fire is going to be in there like 17 times. Just like that's like just a single note dash PK fire. So here's the thing: you grabbed, you should have PK fire. <laughs> Don't work. PK, like what do you do at the PK fire? Well, it depends on the distance, but 90% of the time you could probably throw another PK fire. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, man, just kind of playing with it right now. Very, very slow news game, uh, mostly because of I think just inexperience from Pink Fresh's character. I gotta imagine so. Yes. Okay. Oh. Ooh. All right. So Joe, once again, yo, opted to not go for the chain grab right there. And now Pink Fresh fight a few stocks down. Joe just over here trying to style, basically. Yeah, basically. I mean, this is just destruction at its finest. For Pink Fresh. If. I don't know. Maybe just a little intimidation right there from the man. Lord knows he needs something. Okay. Got to get him with the Rocket Man combo right there, but just can't, didn't get him uh, enough of it. Ooh, he has no jump. Uh, I mean, decent attempt at a follow-up right there. Didn't have to go so extravagant for it, but here we go. Oh, nice stuff right there. Wave land to grab that uh, banana. Or wave dash back to grab the banana. Okay. Wow. See, we huh? mad D for that. All right. Oh, uh, still going to get the punish on the other side, though. And that is set one. Hopefully, he puts that nest back in the box, never to be seen again. Oh, we need to pull that Lucas out. Oh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you. We had to clap it up for the boys. We've done that last set. We've been going, but that's yeah, fine. Yeah, I could be going home right now. But it's all good. It's for the love of the game. Competition and, you know, practice. Talk about that, practice. All that good crap. I mean, right now, he's, he's just the Allen Iverson in this right now. He ain't, he ain't got time to practice. He won't practice in game. That's my practice. <laughs> Give me the ball. The ball, man. I'll show you what it's about. I ain't never used this crossover. I'm about to try it right now, though. I don't care if you give me a turnover or not. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Joe. Wow. Seagull is just moving with them hands right now. And it is looking uh, not, not much of a change from the nest. I mean, this was how last game started. I mean, last time they played. Yeah, it, it did. That first game, absolutely. Oh, yeah. Fresh, um was behind a considerable amount, and he brought it all the way back. He just got to focused. Game one. He ain't focused yet. Oh, here we go. Oh. Focus yet? Still not focused. You'll see it. Nice patience. Man. He's like right now. He's at the optometrist and they're doing a little thing with the uh, with the with the glasses or like this oh, or this. Yeah. And he's getting to that point where he' about to be mad focused. He just ain't there yet. He's like okay, one or two. <laughs> uh, I don't really see a difference. Okay, how about one? <laughs> Dude, Doc, that's the Doc, same, the same thing. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. Man, Seagull Joe right now, he's commandingly. Wow, nice stuff right there. Nice back air um, as a punish. Seagull Joe trying to go. For you know, that's that. I don't. I don't never like seeing that because uh, Junebug and uh, at 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 the Big House Four, Junebug did that, and that was the reason they lost a double set. Really? And so ever since then, I've just never liked seeing that. Just up B just to hit someone. Man, it seems like Seagull always gets so close to beating Pink Fresh. I feel like this might just be the occasion where he actually does it. I think we're still trying that he to actually wins? His, yeah, just trying to find his groove. I mean, it's possible, man. He's looking real good right now. Oh, my God. I mean, Seagull's just, uh, just applying all kinds of pressure here. Oh. Caught that jump. Yeah, oh, we did not get that finish. Yep. Here we go. All right, just, just jumping. Just get whatever punish you can right there. Just a little damage. I mean, 
He could be going for something like the spike, but he's really got to time that uh, perfectly to go ahead and get the real. Oh, nice stuff by Siegel, though. Oh. Nice. Yet again. Isn't that a uh, great Diddy edge? Oh, Ooh. the angle was off. And right now, Siegel looking like he's slated to at least take this first game. Might be a game three game grand finals or game. Uh, three set two grand finals. Uh, yeah, I definitely got to say this. Pick this up, yeah. Clearly, clearly in Siegel's favor. And the thing with Siegel is, he just started the whole game with momentum, and he just he, he literally has not slowed down once. Oh, oh almost had to go follow right there. Now at ninety one percent, I mean, he just needs to get the stock off and hopefully do some pink fresh stuff on that next stock. Cause uh, he's gonna have to do it twice. Oh yeah, twice. I feel like this Diddy stuff though can just. That's going to be enough to definitely take this game right here. Yep, and that's going to be it. My goodness. The downfall. And we are running it immediately back here. Potentially the last game of Grand Finals. Now, Siegel wins. This means he won in Grand Finals 4 up. Mm -hmm. He won. He swept him. He swept him. Now, now the last. Know, you know he's going to pop off. Exactly. You know he's going to pop he's, off. Well, a well deserved pop off. Yeah. I mean, well. I, I, I mean, a semi well he, he he beat someone very important to get here, but the 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 top like five in every tournament is not here today. It's like the top two. Actually. Hey, regardless, regardless, yeah. regardless, it's still a win. A solid a win's win, a win is a solid win. Yeah, I mean, and Plank, you know, uh, you know, we've seen how good he's been getting. I mean, that guy got what second last week? I, I think. think so. Yeah. All right. Well, better start off right now for Pink Fresh, but I mean, it's only an even game right now. All right, Joe's got to find a better way to pull those bananas out. He's getting punished for those quite a bit. Got him off on the stage though, so I mean, even if he uh, gets punished, as long as, long as he can keep him on stage, he might be doing a, might be an even trade. Oh, Ooh. ducked his head and got him on the other okay, side. I like boy, it. Boy, snuck that boy. Oh. Okay. All right, great stuff. Mm. He's a little exposed right there. Yeah, I mean, I saw what he was going for. Just in case um, Sigla had came out of shield with anything or, you know, he would have got hit like that. That move was actually super fast. Just, it's just a pretty much like a get off me move. Uh, and if you hit it, you get to keep your charge. So. Oh, nice. Oh, I hit him with a leg drop right there. Okay. Kind of moving his way up and down through a shield. Nice. Siegel not doing a bad job here. Not at all. And now, I mean, Siegel's actually doing a, a, a wonderful job compared to uh, how I saw he was playing a little earlier. I mean, oh, he was getting wow. styled on for quite a bit. And look how much that barrel oh. helped Siegel here. My goodness. Oh, but he was facing the wrong way. All he that, had to take all that. All that because of the one barrel that bounced Pink Fresh up, and, and Siegel got such a nice conversion, ultimately leading the Pink Fresh is uh, the end of that stock. My goodness. Good stuff from Siegel. That was so clutch in a situation where Pink Fresh was definitely, you know, the aggressor. Mm-hmm. Uh, now he sees Joe just, get, you know, just finding that rhythm. Uh-oh. Oh, but Pink Fresh. Nice. Woo! Taking that man across the stage and back. There we go. Definitely a round trip combo right there. Looking real real good for him, but he's not able to finish it. Really close to doing this. Single Joe just going to go ahead and wait it out. Come out with the uh, hitbox. Now, if he gets this grab, this oh. could be it, but it's looking really good for Single Joe right now. Oh, what? Oh, okay. I like that B-reversal attempt. Yeah, it's going to scoop him up. There's like a million <laughs> different options he could have did right there. He just kept swinging just in case, but... Got the grab. Oh, and I'm pretty sure he did not mean to waste that, but he had the time to uh, recharge it. That time that he used the recharge, though, was the time that uh, Siegel got to set up on the stage, though. So Definitely still a lost cause. Ooh, nice. Pulled back a little bit. Allowed Pink Fresh to drop that shield, and Siegel had a forward smash waiting for him. And now this is this is potentially it for Pink Fresh. Last stock of the tournament, perhaps. He's going to have to turn it up if he wants to take two unanswered from Siegel, who I don't think has any intentions of letting that happen. This man is just on a tear right now. Oh, wow, he didn't have the charge what he was going for, and now Siegel's going to get quite a bit of damage off that. Unfortunate for Pink Fresh, but he's now getting a nice little combo starting for himself. Yes. Wow. Um. And this could very well be... Oh, this could Oh, this could do it. And Siegel's... Uh, no? Not quite? Oh, oh nice interruption with the barrels. This would be the first Project of Xanadu that Siegel has won. Oh, yeah. Oh, and he does it. it. He does it. 4-0 in Grand Final. Sweeps it 4-0 over Pink Fresh. Wow. Wow, fantastic. And that Siegel is, has won a Xanadu. I believe that's his first Xanadu win. Siegel has won a Xanadu. Congratulations. Congratulations to the boy. He's not hes not very good on the mic, but he's great on the sticks. We'll give him that all the time.
That's not true. Yeah, I don't believe That's that. That's not true. That's not true at Apparently. all. <laughs> I don't know why he thinks he's that good. He's like, <laughs> like you're not that good. Anyway, <laughs> I mean, you're good. Though. She ain't that good. You know, calm yourself down. So anyway, that's the end of do. That's it. We'll see you guys tomorrow. We done for some. Oh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. He has school. So, wait, do you have school? Okay, I, I, I thought maybe you'd be out like the middle school December. And stuff. December, mm -hmm. middle of December, I'm done. Okay, so that's when the uh, uh, entire Xanadu will be back, basically. Uh, so, but yeah, thanks for uh, wa watching yet again. Uh, who we rating today? Actually, let me see who. Let me see who's streaming. Myself, like, who shrimp? I'm following six people. All right, Fats is streaming Call of Duty. Smash Studios is streaming. Uh, Asterisk Rocks is streaming. Uh, that was some guy that <laughs> we were watching his stream the other. He's not even. He can't even hear me. Okay, cool. Peachy Hime streaming and Reno streaming. Give it to Fats. Fats. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it, for to me, to me, for me personally, it's either between Fats and Asterisk Rocks because we always raise Smash. Who? Who? Is he? Oh, Korean DJ's playing Smash 4? Wow. <laughs> so okay. that's, is that exciting? I mean, I don't know if that's exciting. Go Tune in real quick. Korean? I mean, who's he playing? Marth? Is he playing Marth? Because that could be exciting. Who? I don't want to watch that. We already have enough Nesses. Next. All right. See who he's playing real quick. I'd give it to Fats. But that's just yeah, I kind of want to give it to Fats. He's playing Lucy. Uh, I can kind of give it. All right. Can we do a double raid then? I want one to, one to go to Fats, and then that, yeah, all right. So, double raid today. Fats is playing Call of Duty Advanced Warfare, if you're down for that. And also, um, my man's Korean DJ, who's playing Lucina. So, mm -hmm. you know, get hyped for that. I'm probably about to go home and watch that right now. I forgot I even had this. Um, the girl, uh, Shafarsart, came back from Japan, and she gave me this. And it's just been sitting in the back of my uh, 